that was good fun i gonna say yeah guys i'm gonna say guys one more time i said it like fifty thousand times this stream today i think it's probably the most common thing i said the whole evening or the whole afternoon or the whole day so the positives the positives about the game physics force feedback sounds like the curb sounds are exceptional like really good so like all the and ai is very nice so like it's very good sim and good racing game the negatives i'm fighting the whole day is a problematic performance issues in terms of ground game breaking like it will piss you off and you will uninstall the game that's how bad I had like UI problems, menu problems. The menu is annoying as hell. It's very nice visual, but there is a problem. It's lagging, it's freezing. You have to like alt up to make it work. Uh, if you want to change the graphic settings, you have to literally like restart the game or you like you, you, you have to load. I have a beast of the computer. It takes me like three, four minutes to get on the track. I don't know, maybe two, three minutes to get on the track. I realized I made a wrong choice with the settings. I have to go back into the menu, possibly restart the game as well, and then join back. So just changing one thing will take you more than five minutes, you know, six minutes. For example, in iRacing or ACC, it's like super quick, instant, and so on. So that's quite annoying. And I had like a big, big problems with the performance when I was driving no problem, and suddenly my FPS dropped to like quarter, you know, on Le Mans, for example. Or I was driving on Algarve, it was completely fine, and then I went to Le Mans, and I had like 5 FPS. I restarted the game, still 5 FPS. So I had to go to different track, different car, and it was fine. So it's like the performance if you issues and the bugs, if they get fixed, this game will be much better, you know? But I must say, like, I don't usually, like, ACC, I'd never play with AI because the AI sucks. But I must say, in this game, the AI, like, guys, rewatch three hours ago, Spa Race with 963, recommending, amazing. Or start on Fuji, that was fun as well. Or this race was fun as well at the beginning, you know, then it started raining and then like when they started raining, they suddenly were a little bit faster than AI, but yeah, but yeah, if you would like me to know, if you like, if you would ask me if I would recommend you this game, I would say, if you would like to give it a go, give it a go, if you will not like it, you can refound it, obviously, or if you are interested in this game and maybe budgeting a little bit, just wait and see if they will fix it. Because I personally will probably play this game tomorrow and then I will see if the developers are fixing the issues. Because if the developers will not be fixing the issues with the performance, I will be like, you know, this is not game for me, you know? So um, I did online race. Uh, the online race was completely fine. The only problem I had, I could not join the session. I had to restart the game to be able to join the session. So it's like, it's like a... I think I, I feel like I'm very critical, but at the same time, very genuine about my opinion about this. It's obviously the game just released, it's early access, it's also obviously Studio 397. We all know Air Factor 2 and we all know the problems around it. I give them a chance to fix the problems. If they will not fix it, well, I will not play the game, you know? But uh, if you genuinely like don't know, I would say either wait or just give it a go and refund you know like one of those two like it's like if you really want to try just try and you will either like it or you will be pissed same as me at the beginning or nils as well uh, as i heard you know so there's like a bit of a lot of options for you like literally like i think nils refunded the game and then he bought it to give it a second chance again or as, at least as that's what my chat said uh my stream first hour was pain as hell to get the game working and make everything work and adjusting because it was like try uh restart try restart try restart and it wasted minutes you know so um yeah so literally guys like if you are like budgeting and you're not sure about it uh maybe like we can try and we can refund if you don't like it or you can you can just like not get it and wait and so on you know so like really like depends on you guys really depends on you like I'm going from this stream myself very happy with driving and having fun and enjoying the racing. Like, I was driving mostly with AI today, but it was really, really good fun. And, and it was really good. Like, this game is sim. This is not like Forza or anything. This game is sim. And it's pretty good. So, yeah, if they will not fix the performance, I will not play it again. But if they will fix the performance, I might give it like a proper go, you know? 
if they will like if this game will not have a driver swap if this game will not have a proper multiplayer if this game will not have a good net code if this game will not have a good performance i will not play it in the future you know but right now i'm just trying it's early access and i will give developers a chance to see you know so that's my opinion guys that's my opinion for 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 the for the Lemon's ultimate so far. I really am going positively from this stream because yeah, I was pretty pissed several times, especially the menu was pissing me off. But uh, I'm going from this, and I'm maybe look. I'm actually looking forward for tomorrow because tomorrow I will probably play it again. I will probably do some races or like maybe some longer race against AI or something just for fun, you know. So uh, yeah, yeah. So yeah, it's also important, guys, to understand it's early access, you know. Like I personally feel a little bit cheated. I was talking about it, I think, on Twitter. I feel a little bit cheated with the early access because I remember the game was supposed to release in December and then they said February and literally four weeks before the release they said it's early access suddenly. So uh, it, I feel like kind of cheated but I kind of understand it but at the same time I will give them that early access doubt and we'll see. Like for me personally if they will improve, I will play it. If they will not improve, I will not play it. If they give it a future for online racing as I like, which is driver swap, endurance stuff, and stuff like that. If they will give it to the game, I will probably play it. If they fix the performance, if not, then no. <laughs> you know? So I hope you guys like my opinion. I will leave it to you guys. I'm going to be back online in literally an hour, guys. In one hour, I'm going to be driving ACC. Uh, now I need to practice and get a little bit of break. Uh, somebody was asking about AI. I do like the AI. You just have to drive in dry, it seems like. In dry, it seems better. Uh, when it started raining, when they were on the slicks, they were, like, very fast. But, uh, yeah, guys, let me know what you think about my uh, my uh, my uh, my stuff. I, I didn't get paid, guys, by... I have nothing to do with this game. I bought it for 30 euro in the afternoon and download it and stream it for you because it's content for me it's a and it's a game I, i'm, I'm sim racing for 20 years i was just looking forward for a new game and see how it's gonna perform you know i was pretty questionable about the game 50 50 for it so far i'm still like 60 40 uh positive negative so the Depends, you know, it depends if they will fix the stuff I, I, I need them to fix. But now, guys, I need to go for uh, for dinner or I need to eat something at least and go practice. And in one hour, like 10 minutes, guys, we're going to be live with the eSport ACC Data Lab Driver Swap Renvelton Series. Two one-hour races with Driver Swap on solder with BMW with Mathieu. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. Let me know in the comments, by the way. Uh, and it really helps if you leave a like, subscribe say something you know and uh and <laughs> and uh, thank you very much don't forget to join our community on discord as well guys and twitter and such green green let's go oh. nice dude click in the house you little shit there's an mp2 right behind me green 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 This is pretty cool though, not gonna lie. Like, like the driving is great. Oh, oh my God, those medium tires were big mistake. This is, when you're driving, this is great. When you're driving, the game is great. When you drive like this, the game is great. When you have performance issues, it sucks ass. And when you're driving on the medium towers, it's not recommended. Whew. Oh, oh. Guys, leave a like if you enjoyed the stream. Thank you very much, by the way. percent I should have been on soft tires most likely but let me see the curves are like uh, 11 out of 10 I love those curves they're the best curves I've ever heard and 
felt in any game. That's the biggest plus. So you have the great sound, great physics, great curves, ship performance. <laughs> but I think everything I'm saying can be fixed, by the way, guys. So, yeah. As you can see, guys, we had a lots of lots of issues, but when we actually drive, it is great. Like when we actually are driving, it's actually really good. The tires are getting warm. Let's go. The tires are getting warm. And I was right on my ass. <laughs> oh, he was trying to send it on me. Guys, if you if you would forgot the first hour of the stream where we were fighting with the performance and could have not used the spot Le Mans and such. What do you think about the game right now? Like, right, just this race, if you watch. Pretty good, no? 